Good morning, guys. This is not a good angle. Hi. <laughs> That's not a good angle either. Ooh, this must be a good angle. This whole vlog is gonna be me looking for a good angle. It is, um... I don't think I can read analog clocks. Like, it takes me way too long. I'm so... I think I'm stupid. I'm like, nine. Okay, so nine's there. Ten. Okay, ten, twenty. It's too long. My brain can't process that. Harji and I are going for a little walk because we're trying to start our days off with a walk, so... This necklace is constantly tangling. It's so annoying. All right, this is a fit. <laughs> this is my go for a walk fit. I saw a dead bird. It looks so sad. It looks so sad. Not a way I want to start my day. I'm so sad now. It looks so cute. It was just like. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big ass pine cone. This is my hand. That's my hand and that's the pine cone. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> I woke up with allergies today. I took my pill, I took my spray. But sometimes when I wake up like this, it's kind of a wrap, but I'm trying to like get through it. Also, I have leg day, which brings me to the point that I've been going to the gym mad consistently, I'm not gonna lie. But whenever it comes to leg day, oh man. For what? Like I do understand it makes up half my body, but like just a half that doesn't really count, you know what I'm saying? Also, I've been trying to tell myself that I'm not going to the gym consistently, I'm the type of person that just goes to the gym. There we go. And that kind of helps. It's like a mindset shift. Yeah. Kind of gross. I thought it'd be kind of cute if you just sat down. We can stand near the bench. I think it's just the color. Like, I don't see anything on my hand. Oh, yeah, you're right. It's bright. Life's been good. Life's been busy. Oh my God, guys. We just booked our ticket back home. We're going home for the first time in so long. Harjit still hasn't gotten his visa yet, so there's a chance that he might be stuck there, but it's fine. We're gonna make it work. Canada vlogs, guys. We can finally see baby Rue. We can see our family, and uh, it's gonna be a good time. So, October. October. This right here is mint. You grow mint in your yard, it goes insane. Look at this. Are we sure this is mint? This is 100% mint. Smell it, it's mint. Oh yeah. Like I might have to take this home and put it in like a mojito or something. <laughs> Leg day. So Harji is at the gym and I actually work out in the garage. If you guys didn't know, we have like a whole setup here. We got the weights, we got the bench. I realized that my body is definitely more of a body weight exercise person. Lifting weights kind of stresses out my body, like lifting heavy, heavy weights. But for the most part, I kind of just do yoga and Pilates and like body weight exercises. I do a lot of like headstands and push-ups. I don't count my calories. I don't watch my eating habits. It's like pretty 80-20. It's just moving my body as long as I'm stretching, as long as I'm walking, I'm good. And it's weird. Listening to your body does so much. I feel like once I tuned out people online that are like, do this, do this, do that. I realized that you just gotta listen to your body and also do what feels good for you. Like if I don't have a plan going into the gym, I have the best workout. <laughs> How hard you today was like, I gotta hit my legs today. And he's like kind of dreading it. I'm like, okay, I'm excited. And I like come and I'll do some stretches. And I'm like, you know what? I haven't hit my legs in a while. Let me just do that. Let me do some squats. Let me focus on my hamstrings. Let me focus on this part of my body. And I just feel it out. And it works for me guys. It works for me. And I just like, put on YouTube. We have a TV up here. We have a TV up here. And I just do whatever I feel. Like there's no method to my madness. Harji thinks I'm a psycho, but sometimes I just work out with no music on. It's just silent in here. And I'm just with my thoughts. Is that weird? I was pointing to the scissors for thinking. We got a little package from, oh, this works kind of perfectly. Right? It can't be a vlog without a PR package. That's all I'm saying. We knew this one was coming and I'm so excited about this. You guys don't know who Radhi is? I think she's a cookbook girl. Our place, this is not sponsored. They have a Diwali pan. We already have a pan from them, which they also sent us. And then they were like, oh, we have a Diwali plan. Do you guys want it? And we're like, hell yeah. It has a little gold little handle thing with like a saffron on it. They sent us another one yesterday. Imagine this. Put this over here. Gotta get this one. How many things are you cooking? We're cooking a whole, whole ass meal right here. That looks like Christmas. Look at that. It doesn't look like Christmas. It does look like Christmas. <laughs> Shout out to our place. I'm not gonna lie, this is not sponsored, but I think we have a discount code we will link down below because like uh, these pants. Green juice. We are about to go run some errands. We just released a new sketch called Men vs. Women. Go watch it. It's on our other channel. We have some props that we need to return. So we're gonna go do it together. 
I don't like how it's like plastic. There's a reason it's on clearance. It's not clearance. This is just five dollar items. This is Jazz's favorite aisle. But she never gets anything from them. Sometimes I do. You have 19 planners, yeah? I don't. This girl's obsessed with planners, bro. Imagine buying these and then using them as cups after. That's like a two in one. Or like even like these, like you just use it as like a bowl. So you get a candle, but then you got these cool bowls. Put like almonds in there and stuff. <laughs> this is Jazz in her natural habitat. Target. I like this lampshade. You've never heard the term crock of shit? No. It's a real term. It means something considered to be complete nonsense. I've never heard that. In movies? I've heard pile of shit. Guys, comment below. Let me know. Have you heard the phrase crock of shit? I want this. So I can be like shh. You can be like shh. I find these dolls so creepy, yo. They're right? really creepy. Especially this one. Juanita? Kind of looks like you, I'm not gonna lie. You're giving me Juanita vibes. <laughs> should we get this for Ru? Or should we have babies? I'm just gonna go over here. Trick or treat, creepy crawler. He told you creepy crawler. What the hell? Imagine he was like trick or treat, bitch. <laughs> We're pretty much the same size. Totally. My boy, man. Hey, that's my man. Seven feet gay, baby. We have to get this for Leo. Oh my god. Isn't that so cute? Is this too big for Leo, though? We get a smaller size. It's a large or XL. Imagine this was Leo. That's so cute. That'd be mad cute, bro. What is this? It could be a, a dinosaur. dinosaur. That's cute. And it's a small. This is too small, right? There's no medium? No. How about large? Large is too big. What the heck? Do you want me to hold something? Nah. We forgot to get a cart or a basket. So now I'm the cart and the basket. These are not turning out good. Don't even show them this. This is so disappointing. Maybe one more minute. I think I might have accidentally added too much flour or not enough butter. What happens is when you melt butter, evaporation happens and maybe too much of the butter evaporated. And I put the same amount of flour I always do, but it might have been too much flour. Or you could have put too many chocolate chips. I think there was such thing as too many chocolate chips. That's what I thought. Yesterday we got home and I don't know what happened. We were so tired, yo. And then the tire just took over. But now it's a brand new day. As you can see, man's are looking a little sharp. Got a little haircut. I think my hair looks so funny right now, though. I'm not gonna lie. I look great. I think you I'm not wearing my hair like this. Why not? I hate it. Guys, rate the hairstyle in the comments right Guys, now. Guys, tell them that it looks good. You can't be looking like you're a 22 year old fuckboy for the rest of your life. I don't. I look like me. My hair is this tall. Imagine. My short king. That'd be so funny. Oh my god, my short king. You wouldn't even go out with somebody that was shorter than you. Why not? I'm a personality person, clearly. What the fuck? Yo, that's crazy. I wish somebody was here that give a high five to you. You think you're funny? <laughs> I just said you had a great personality. <laughs> that's crazy. Yo, earlier today, Jazz was like insulting my outfit. I didn't insult your outfit. I just said, is that what you're wearing? That's literally the biggest outfit insult. If someone hits you with a, is that what you're wearing? Go change. You're wearing your bedtime shirt out. I literally have not worn this shirt to bed. This is my gym shirt. <laughs> When I need to look good, you know I look good. Wow, I look good for you all the time. I wake up in the morning, I'm like, I'm gonna go look good for my husband, you know? Make sure he knows that he married someone who takes care of themselves. I take care of myself. Hit the gym every day, taking care mm -hmm. of my insides. Hits the gym for a week. Are you quick? <laughs> Hits the gym for a week. Oh my God! I hit the gym every day. It's been way more than a week. It been eight days. Let me pull out my Ali Fitness app. Oh my God, what is going on today? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. That's almost two weeks. Proud of you. These cookies better be good. Cause this is half the reason that we're together are these cookies, so. I won't start making these cookies like literally a year ago. I had the vision. From the day I met you, I knew at some point you were gonna crack the code. So I stuck around. Crack the cookie code? I was like, at some point, this is the girl that's gonna crack the chocolate chip cookie code. So yo, you better go, go. <laughs> yo, chop chop. <laughs> chop chop what? Bring me the cookies, yo, come on. All those cookies are going to my stomach. <laughs> It's like crumbly. What is this weird cookie you made? I don't know. I'm oh, so wait. sad. It's cookie. literally never looked like this. Ever. Ever in the history of me making cookies. It looks like an oatmeal cookie. It really does. It's still really good. It's still good. I think I overcooked it though. So a week ago, Jazz did like a comedy show. She hosted a comedy show. Welcome to Comedy and Crafts Night. Featuring Shades of Funny, that is us. That is us, Shades of Funny. And she performed at that comedy show. RG held it down. Yo, you know how I do. He was the film guy, he was the lighting guy, and he made sure the sound worked. But it went really well. We had like a comedy and crafts night. We had a great lineup. I performed. Killed it. My husband is a Twitch streamer. <laughs> 
Twitch streaming is like OnlyFans for gamers. <laughs> Body it. But it went really well. For your first show too. Mm-hmm. Killed it. All right, it is dinner time and I am making chicken. I just put like paprika, fresh garlic, oil. I'm buttering the pan up to make the chicken in. And then I think I'm just gonna make some like bow tie pasta. Chicken carb, call it a day. Got some bow tie pasta on deck. Harji is like, you know what? We can't have pasta without a baguette. So he literally just went to the grocery store to get a baguette. We're serious about our pasta nights here, okay? If you don't have a baguette with your pasta, what are you doing? timer for 10 minutes. If you know, you know. It's time. It's time for the Christmas sweater? Yeah. It's not Christmas, but it's the only sweater we have. Clear your Christmas top. Oh yeah. I'm obsessed with your pasta. Every day I ask Jazz, yo, can we have pasta? Do you want me to go get a baguette? Look at this. How could you not want this every day? And then we got Jazz's oatmeal cookies. It's not oatmeal. Better eat your veggies. Veggies? I gotta get the bevies. And today's bevy is some bubbly. And there we have it, folks. <sighs> We're also watching Saturday Night Live from the beginning, 1975. Is that crazy? Most of the jokes are not relatable. Like the color, it's so like grainy, it's crazy. And it's also so different to like what SNL is now. I feel like if you want to do something, Jazz, if y'all don't know, Jazz wants to be on SNL. That's like one of her dreams. You gotta study the craft. You gotta watch it. Exactly. So we're watching it from the beginning. It'll probably take us like four years to finish it, but it's okay. I have been obsessed with this whole Diddy thing. Sometimes I'm like, should I start a podcast? I need to be that TikTok channel that just talks about it. Cause I have like literally just spewed out information every single time I see Harji or like any of my friends. I'm like, okay, so this happened and then this happened and then 2019, this happened, but then in 2016, this happened. And then Tupac and Biggie, that was P Diddy. The craziest part about everything is that Tupac and Biggie never had a beef, allegedly. <laughs> yeah, I have just been going down rabbit holes, Kim Porter release. I don't know who Kim Porter is. Who? Them. Google it. No, I'm kidding. Kim Porter was P. Diddy's children's mother, Kim Porter, who passed away in 2018 from pneumonia. Ooh. Pick your tea. Do you want some energy? You want some pepper in your stuff? Yeah. I'm gonna do these two green teas. Okay, deal. Okay, so Kim Porter, P. Diddy's kid's mother, passed away in 2018, okay? From pneumonia. Coincidentally, apparently, all of her exes also died of pneumonia. Hmm, weird, right? Yeah. Yo, you need to make a TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> but apparently this book that came out that Kim Porter apparently wrote, her kids are saying that she didn't write it. They're like, none of it is true. But how do you know that? So everything you broke down for me yesterday yeah. could potentially be not true? I told you that. I was like, it could also be not true. The only person we could ask if it was true or not is Kim Porter and she's not alive anymore. All right, it is the end of September, which means fall decor, Halloween decor is going up, especially if we're gonna be in Toronto for most of of October. This is Skelly, yo. Skelly's been with us for a while. This is the main piece. I just don't know where we're gonna put this guy. This. Orange. Yes. Yes. Do we have Halloween stuff? It has costumes. I know, who would like this? Who? Diddy. Oh my God. We got Halloween lights. We got this guy. Pumpkins. This is like very Halloween-y. Like I want like fall decor. Golden ladder, bro. Yeah, tall enough, okay? Eh? What the fuck you say? You're tall enough? I'm tall enough, dog. This is definitely Christmas, right? Yeah. No. Yeah. We just gotta make our own fall decor. How? I paint paint, right? Complete. That's it. It's good, right? We got this little bad boy here, another fall friend. This is pathetic though, I'm not gonna lie. This is pathetic. We have a four story home. Guys, I think we're failing at fall this year. I don't know where any of my fall stuff went. I feel like I might've just thrown it out. It's actually kind of cool. You might be onto something. Is that cool? Wait. Yo. Kind of a vibe. You kind of cooked with that. Good job. Okay, I have this bouquet of just random stuff that I kind of created. So I'm gonna take all the orange and like fall colored ones and put them everywhere. I feel like even the red, everything except for like the blue, right? The blue is not giving fall. How's that? More or less? More, like one more. Can't tell if this is cute or not cute. What do we think? There, 
That's good. This looks perfect. Except for this pink light. We should paint this light. Yeah. It's pink for no reason. I got my toque on, my beanie, because I wanted to be part of the decor. <laughs> now I am also fall themed. Somebody needs to tell Leo to get with the program. This guy's a Christmas pup. Leo, you need a Christmas sweater, Bubba. We kind of fallified our house a little bit. As much as we could. Thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out our new sketch on our sketch channel. Yes, men vs. women. Merch is still available. Yes, it is. Go grab that. YouTube TV.com. <sighs> Good night. Peace.